Here we go. Is it? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Ready? <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog. Wait, he Excuse says me. this. Shadow the Hedgehog uses an auto <laughs> <Uses season. laughs> If you, you wish to save, you wish to save Maria. Maria, yeah, you must have a memory card. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> He's shooting Maria in the background. <laughs> Sonic team. It should be Shadow though. Team for this game. Okay, yeah, question. Cross it out. Question. I am playing this now, but am I going to be the only one playing it? Yes. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Ideally, nobody else wants to play it. Nobody <laughs> wanted yeah. to play it. You uh, insisted up and down the walls I that this was your favorite Sonic. This, game, this the cut scene, school? This cutscene blew like. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. Stay in. Like, fucking Sandy hook joke in the first five seconds. Like, you know, I should ask you to cut that out. This is like. <laughs> The first thing I thought when Shadow of the Hedgehog was coming on is how many school shooter jokes and Columbine references yeah, are we gonna make? Come on. That's the aesthetic though of like the mid two thousands, like the Matrix and yeah. this. This, and this really is just like an allegory. Yeah. Yeah. There, there really was a time this is when like it, school what, shooter chic was in. I would like to. And think, you know what? Yeah. I thrived in it. I lived for it. Yeah. I wanted to come back. The only problem is Shadow's guns in this game look like they're made by Hasbro. Like they're not intimidating <laughs> at all. You got these little but wussy chow guns. If he walked towards you like that, yeah, that yeah, look yeah, of you, would pee. I would you would pee. I would pee. I would and you poop. And you poop. <laughs> I would piss. That's me, Corey. You sending my bed to kill you. If I was a kid and I That's saw me. all this, I'm starting my off with the soldiers to take you down. If I you saw this <laughs> at the start, this this would have blown my fucking Chris, mind. Chris, it did blow my mind. I'm telling you, that's what I was gonna did say. You see that? He strangles them. These oh. and this, even for a cutscene, it's like nice and smooth. Looking. It's really nice. This looking. was the first video game cutscene I was ever blown away by. Yeah, it is really he good. He killed Sonic. He did because he was a dumb jock and he knew better. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Here, wow, 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 wow. Have I ever told the story of how I came to acquire this wonderful game? No. 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 What's what's the origin? I uh, I walked into a GameStop and there was like a parent trying to. Uh, Corey, shut the fuck up. Sorry. I walked into a GameStop and there was a parent trying to return it. Oh, you did tell and us this. And the kid was like shrieking and throwing a temper tantrum. Because yeah. what the mom saw a gun in the game or yeah, something. Something like I don't even know what it was about, but for some reason the employee was like not having it, and mm -hmm. the eventually the mom just got so frustrated. That that she like stormed out and she's like, "Do you want this?" And I was like, "Yeah." <laughs> I, I just got How it. How old were you at that point? Um, maybe like I don't know, 12, 13. Gruesome image. And that was the point where you like <laughs> you made everything. Image. It's like a vignette playing. Show Maria's head. face getting shut up realistically. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right there. Who is Maria? Oh, yeah, that's, that is what Wait, he's saying. I'm remembering he doesn't know Maria, who Maria is. but what? Huh? Uh? His amnesia is fucking weird. It uh? makes no sense. That looks good. Black hole in the sky. Yeah. The black it's aliens. It's like a red, red hole. Big red prolapse. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That's the horrid diarrhea at a microscopic Those level are all the spilling out in the We just saw this yeah. cutscene. No, we didn't. Not this. We saw the yeah, they knocking reused the car it. away. They Pathetic. This city deserves to die. That is what he's basically saying. Yeah. Oh, you're joking, but it is. No, I know. I love when this guy just sounds like Dr. Claw. Like, I love the villainous, like, n like 80s cartoon style of, like, over-the-top, like, I'm evil. Yeah, some voice actor yeah. has throat polyps from doing that. Yeah. And it was so worth it. But you then you hear villains now, and they have, like, filters on them, and they're, like, super evil-sounding, and yeah. it's not as interesting, because it's just generic. No, the one that the one that fucks with me is uh, Starscream, because it's literally just some guy going, ah! and it's like, <laughs> Jesus, man. But that always works, though, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Just overtly evil, demonic entities is great. I'm just talking about the guy right. in the booth that has to drink a bunch so of fucking thing, throat like code afterwards. Yeah. I just want to say, the thing about this game what is, what is it called? there's hero, neutral, and dark. Mm. And it, it... It's a branch. It, like, branches <laughs> off, and whatever level you beat, like, whatever you do changes the playthrough. Westopolis. So you, so you play Westopolis, like, 16 times, I think. Westopolis <laughs> sounds like some dumb shit you'd say, Chris. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Welcome to Westopolis! That's like Dragon Ball Dragon Ball Z. Well, that really just started you, you off, You go to West it? City. Promise time, huh? Why is his voice? Why is, he's like whispering. It's like ASMR. <laughs> no, he's cool. Shadow the Hedgehog yeah. ASMR. Was this the first game where they used the the show cast that everyone hates? Oh, the for Shadow. For the, uh, for Actually, the... I think this is like with Jason Griffith. Yeah. What should I do? Should I be evil or good? I Corey... think we should turn down the video game. Yeah, it's a little loud. <laughs> should I be good or though, evil? Uh, what do you guys? I maybe, think maybe evil. you should. Yeah, let's go evil. Let's go evil. Right, let's murder and maim. 
Corey, are you gonna beat this 100% like Sonic Heroes? There's no way. Good. You're gonna beat 110, right? <laughs> I, I've told you before, like, I, Corey, you the know, speed limit's 25, so try to follow that. Ugh. I, no, no, it's like, I've told you before, like, oh, I took his gun. That you love this game? Die! Yeah, no. get him. <laughs> yeah, I hate this game. I just, uh, I've never liked it. Maybe we should do one all the way evil run and one all the way good run. And, yeah, also, yeah. and also one all the way neutral run. Yeah, one, one really neutral like... Neutral's the easiest because you just run to the end. Do you want to start with that then? Yeah, we'll just fucking... I'll mm. just kill people as I'm going. That's always a good idea. Yeah. I like how you can just kill guys. I don't remember killing guys ever in this game. You Wait, can hold into him too. Into people? Yeah, he's been killing cops. Yeah, shooting, he's just he's murdering shooting random people. Cops. Yeah, shooting Excuse them. Excuse me, I belt. And not only that, it's fucking giving you a tally at the top left there. It's like saying that's my murderous rampage. A hit list like, uh, thing. Holy shit! When see? it gets red, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Did you see all that blood? How can you, it really is, it, you know. How look, can you not like this it's game, a bold, Corey? It's a bold it game, like Corey. Shit. But Corey, it's a bold you game. See that? It beat its ass. Oh, Shadow's got stretchy legs. Yeah, Corey, it's would gross. you? Well, he does. Corey, if you had a glass of wine mm -hmm. and Shadow was on your couch, like inching closer to you, mm -hmm. and, give it to him. Well, no, no. Well, if you spilled some wine, he said, "Oh, I'm sorry, I, <laughs> I spilled some wine, Corey." On how, my couch? On your couch? How foolish of me! Oh my God! <laughs> how, how silly of me! I guess I'm a little bit reckless and silly. Yeah. Okay, where is this going? These emeralds are going to my head. They're making me <laughs> silly, Corey. Corey, you, you look at his lips. He's got little, like, peach fuzz. <laughs> I've been it out all month for you, Corey. I, dr I draw my finger. I draw a <laughs> smiley face around his lips. It's going to make him look like a joker. <laughs> Why did With you what? do that? that? I'm felt, trying to be serious That felt amazing. <laughs> You have the touch of an angel. Oh god, I hate this. Damn, that felt good. Damn. Damn, Damn I'm in love. Just no, I mean, like this. <laughs> Damn, more like that. <laughs> more like this. You're not gonna tell Amy, are you? More like this, Korea. less like that. Korea! <laughs> Corey J. Beck. We meet That's at last. That's my name, don't wear it we out. Fuck at last. <laughs> we fuck- Oh! Long time no fuck. Watch this, I can explode. Corey, you're stretching me. <laughs> <laughs> you're positively destroying me. <laughs> I'm uh, not even paying attention. I I this game doesn't have much to pay attention to. <laughs> Do you think, Corey, remember how he told us years ago he sat on a CD case? Do you think Shadow ever sat on the Emeralds just to see what it felt like? It's just to see what it felt like. Absolutely. I'm not gay, but I just want to see what it felt like. He has an Emerald at all times. He probably put one up there and broke it yeah, with his ass. He ex. always has an Emerald at all times. He did it to sneak through security. At the, the where else is he going to store it? Yeah, think about that. It's like a guy so in prison. Have like, you heard about like all the stuff you can store in your ass so when guys in prison, they store like... The Tinder DS, the Tinder 3 ES, they store like... Pack of cigarettes. I, you know what I actually heard? Uh -huh. I heard that the most common way things are smuggled in are actually by people who work there. It's not like the the lie is that it goes in through their ass. The most common thing is that people just bring cigarettes. No, I really in was stuff watching. I really was watching a real thing there. from like uh, people that deal with that, and they there's a name for it. They call it's there's it's called smugglerinos. Like, it's like an asshole purse or something. There's a name for it. Prison wallet. Prison wallet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm talking <laughs> yeah, about. Yeah, yeah. But guys really do, <laughs> they do slowly stretch their assholes out with goods and certain, like, uh, good, good little treats. Uh. I think, yeah, they, they have a guy that commits, like, the lowest level felony that you could possibly do, and he's just got an asshole full of cigarettes. Yeah, yeah and he smuggles them in and yeah. pops them out like Pez the he, smuggles, he smuggles them in, lives like royalty in jail for a month, gets let out, and then does it all over again. This guy is extremely important, by the way. This is, is this is the old man from the Sonic 2 movie, if you're wondering really? who it is. Oh, really? Do you remember the guy in, uh, in Rachel's wedding? I took a screen the the shot guy? of him. The, no, the, the guy, guy who keeps oh, giving him Panera the Bread hair. coupons or whatever the fuck? <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, he did, right? He gave him, like, a uh, garden, uh, Olive Garden. Olive Garden, that's it. He, yeah. Because they make that joke, like, four times. It was They're so like, good the they had Olive to use Garden it guy? He's got different colors. He's got Christian eyes. Yeah. That's Christian in the future. Yeah, this, this, is, this, this, this is Christian this is after he escaped real from prison happening. the sewers. Yeah. This is the alternate timeline. I love this SWAT guy standing like an anime girl. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> they just replaced the model. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't punish me. I love PS2 uh, children's game Chris? Army Men. This what? is GameCube. This story doesn't it make was on PS2. Zach. This story doesn't make any sense. Zach? Ooh, it was on PS2, all. Zach. Wow. You made Run. a mistake. It's fine. You just made a mistake. <sighs> Runs a Let's Play channel, isn't even a real gamer. Hmm. Ooh. Literally. Fuck 
fucking hates video games with a burning passion? Oh yeah, I forget you. Uh, I collected really an heavy. emerald. Can you hold one for me? Each one of these represents Chris Chan's eyes. Like Shadow in this is always just like, don't talk to me, I have plans. And he's just going to the next emerald. <laughs> and he doesn't know why. He's like an evil alien. What's His walk cycle yeah. is real fucked here. Yeah, why is he doing this? He's carrying he's two walk, emeralds. They're the heavy. Professor. He's walking like a T-1000. <laughs> <laughs> Maker. What did you say? <laughs> Silence! <laughs> he's like, what did you say? <laughs> Quiet! <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> I am Jesus Christ and I'll be dead. <laughs> 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 I forgot he made that noise. <laughs> Oh no, I did the neutral only! Corey. I guess we're only doing neutral. Yeah. Let's do a neutral run, and then an evil run, and then a good run. Yeah, that'll be fine. And then we could just look up the fucking end on the internet. Yeah, yeah. 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 said we did it. Yeah. <gasps> I mean, cut this out! This is not gonna make it in, but cut that part out. But yeah, we'll just steal it from some other smaller channel. But cut this out. Yeah, don't leave that in, editor. We want to definitely them. Yeah. also flag the channel so it must like get deleted. Flag it, flag it, uh, get their email removed. Ooh. I'm at the Great Wall of China. He what always the does hell? this. Oh. Every time it opens up, he's like, "Where am I now?" Like, Why the fuck would the Mayans built that? Yes, it's in outer. It's in the sky. They don't run around like Sonic. Dude, you could not be wronger than <laughs> Shadow. You just were. <laughs> when they were sacrificing the Quetzalcoatl, they went through those loops. Oh, the heads yeah. rolled through that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. I love that movie. What's it called? Uh, Apocalypse Now. Mm. Uh, with Democracy Spoonie? Now? Uh, Apocalypto. Apocalypse oh, Now. By yeah, yeah. Deep Song. You're talking about Spoonie? No, you fucking We're talking o. about Spoonie running through this, these hoops. Uh. It's me, your friend, Knuckles! <laughs> it is true. Everyone's like, hey, Shadow, there's a bunch of bad guys here. We need to stop them. And I'm just gonna, like, I run forgot past he was them. in this game. I thought this was, it was just Sonic in the Canucks? game. Canucks? Yep, I thought he No, they're all in it. What are you holding? An alien gun. An alien gun. I guess they have met, but it's weird that they, they, they don't you're... have like a conversation like, Hey, no, I thought it's... you were dead. It's two characters that don't normally Nothing interact has, too much. Uh, he has amnesia. I don't think they've ever said a word to each other. Yeah. Yeah, but if Shadow has amnesia, then he wouldn't know who the fuck Knuckles was. So he'd be like... Yeah, he doesn't know Maria. Well, if I was but... Shadow and I didn't know Knuckles was, I'd be like, He has my same proportions. We must be related. We have to be friends now. Yeah. Well, Chris, that's what you were saying. You only make friends with people that are your exact proportions, right? Pretty much. Yeah. I like that we're all like six foot three. Like, exactly. Kind of gross. Well, looking if, you're, dudes. if your arms like were a little buff. bit longer and shorter, we would not be friends. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm not friends with short arms. I'm constantly comparing my forearm length with and girls. Tell, well, tell the class what it's like. You're always losing, right? <laughs> <laughs> you see this shit? God damn! God fuck. <laughs> that pisses my ass off some, some kind, kind of fucking bad. badly. Anyway. Anywho. Go stand on that. If anybody doesn't know what that that's is, a that's from an old 1930s black and white movie. I just wanted movie. you to step on yeah. it. It's, it was just, Wait, it was do you want me to? I mean, I can, I can use a, it to teleport back. It's just a reference. Yeah, that's your cast it over. That's the last line of the movie. I'm trying to grab this thing. Time to shoot thing. a man in the head. I'm supposed to get the jewel, but I'm not going to. I always find statues that rotate to turn to face you to be very frightening. Mm -hmm. If I walked into an art museum and all the statues slowly turned at me, I'd be really scared. Yeah. Especially if you're Guys, the only person in the museum. As an yeah. April Fool's prank. For April Fools, yeah, we okay. should we should each yeah. obtain a six foot tall statue <laughs> that will rotate to face Chris, and then all put put them into his house slowly when he sleeps. That seems yeah, like, yeah. and then he's gonna wake task. up and he's gonna see statues rotating to face him. And then the best part is when he walks up to inspect it, a giant needle comes out and injects him with something very quickly, <laughs> an unknown <laughs> substance. <laughs> You're like, what is? <laughs> no! Oh! And you feel it pumping into your veins, and you see scarabs from the mummies crawling through your, oh, your skin. Oh God! <laughs> and then Zach calls me like Walter White, and he's like, "That's the ricin going through your system." You, you're probably feeling sick, huh? Hello, Lydia. Hello. Chris. <laughs> he calls her like that. Oh, yeah. Hello, Lydia. Hello, Lydia. Let me tell you something. These references. Well, Corey, you're Corey, stupid. Breaking Bad ended a decade ago. <laughs> yeah. You need to fucking get caught up, man. <laughs> and I'm talking about, I actually just started rewatching it, just started rewatching it. Do you want to hear a story? They, uh, they use horrible slurs in the first few episodes, guys. Don't yeah, watch it. Yo, Mr. White, you... Actually, he does. He does. Yeah, he I know. does say... I know. And Hank Tagomi called and he says, homo. Why are you a couple of homos yes. or something? Yes. Tagomi? Do you guys want to hear about when I went on tour? Yes. 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 Absolutely. Okay. So I can Set tell you the about... tone. Set the mood. Where right. were you? What, what was the date? Well, the mood the was... Year. Okay, the, the, the minute. The, the year was 2022. 20, what color was the walls? 
I was the. It was in the office. I okay. was sitting. I think I had my hand in a box of goldfish. Position your feet. Uh, they were <laughs> not what in front of me. Doing? I think my legs were spread on the couch where one was up and the oh, other one was down. Fuck. What Fortnite dance were you doing? I don't know how to do any <laughs> Fortnite dances. Were you twerking like she walk and make a beast down? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that was bad. You said that like you said you said like you got caught, Corey, like if you're head to the cooking jar, yeah. yeah really? you, said, you saw me as a lawyer when I went <laughs> and then I ran off the podium. I love say what you will, I love the uh, the Mars Leads Mobs graphics. Go ahead. Sorry, go ahead. That's the, okay, well the story is I, this has to do with airports. I don't know how bad you guys hey, Sonic shut up. No, 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 please, for the love of God. I just Okay, so like you guys know how bad airports are now, and if yeah. you don't, you should, because it's almost like unanimous now that airports are so bad. American Airlines is probably the worst airport, just fucking period. You mean They're an airline? They don't have an airport. <laughs> well, I mean, you know what I mean. Yeah. American Airlines is the worst one, Corey, you're right. Yeah, they're, it fucking, is. they're fucking terrible, but... Anyways, when I was supposed to see Dylan, because we were going on tour for my band, The Third Rates, which... Um, is the band I never said that what my band was originally but we, we were going on tour and we took the American Airlines and it was only an I thought hour you, I thought you were Christian and the Hedgehog Boys no it was only an hour and a half away right but they just couldn't they would not give me this fucking flight in fact that day I got an alert on my phone that says your flight has been cancelled and I was like what and then I looked online to try and find a new flight to like you know set up and there were no flights available not a single flight was available for American Airlines and then I looked online and apparently there was like 1200 flights that were cancelled that day on like oh, I flew, I flew back from that fucking adult swim thing that weekend dude my yeah, flights yeah, also yeah. got yeah yeah, yeah it was stuck. dude it was fucked but the worst part oh it gets worse <laughs> It's Look not simply it's bad. Oh yeah, it's bad. It's not simply Look like Look at his Sonic can cylinder head, dude. Yeah, I love how he looks. He looks exactly how he did in Sonic Adventure 2. I love how they look. I love the humans in these games. Yeah. He has so, a I'd vote for President Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> President, he has a President pol Longhead. Is it polar animus? Is that what it's called? When you have when you have a relationship with both polyamorous? He has a polyamorous relationship with who? With who? Lyle? With them? <laughs> yeah, with them too. Then what did you like to know? <laughs> well, he keeps a picture of both of them on his desk. What's that big, that's what's that big yellow son. cum state? I, that's, <laughs> that's right next to the fucking button to launch the nukes is that. That's his do it for her. I want to fuck Shark the Hedgehog. I want to fuck Shadow the Hedgehog. Alright, so that? I'm going to go back into talking about the, uh, the flight. So they canceled my flight. So I set up with a new flight for American Airlines where I actually got to the flight place. And when I got inside the next day, I was able I was able to get to Boston. Um, but during that day, they had canceled my first flight to go somewhere, and they got me with a new flight as I was already stuck in Boston. And the next flight was for 6 p.m., which they canceled, and moved it to 7 p.m., which they canceled, moved it to 8 p.m., which they canceled, moved it to fucking back to 7 p.m. for some reason, which they already fucking canceled, and then they told me that my next flight will be at 8.30 at this other gate. So I had gone to, like, four different gates, and by the last gate we were at, all these motherfuckers got off the previous plane after it pulled up. So there were people off the fucking plane, and they were like, we're just waiting on the captain, and I was already having a pit in my stomach. Lo and behold, Hold, 10 minutes later, the, they're like, we don't have a captain, so we're canceling this flight too. And I went to the fucking customer service table, and I was talking to people there. There was this one lady, I swear to fuck, she just had to get to like St. Louis, and she had been in an airport for four straight days. Jesus. Was canceled flights from American Airlines. And they, uh, and here's another thing that people don't fucking know, but before we get to that, I want to talk about what happened. So... I went to the desk, it took about 40 minutes to go to the fucking desk, and by the time I talked to the person, it was, it was, it was a fucking assistant who sets up fucking flights. It was an actual assistant who works inside of flight stuff. She set me up a flight. She's like, oh, we just found an opening, and I'm like, cool. And when I got outside to get on my fucking, because I had to go to a hotel, because it was coming the next day around like five, yeah. they canceled it the second I got outside. The <laughs> second. The one they set up, they canceled. And I, I almost had a fucking, my, my brain was shutting down. Like, uh, I was drooling, had my face shut down. Like, I had a fucking stroke. I was losing my mind. And when I got to this fucking hotel, which, by the way, isn't free. They do this fucking thing called, um, like, I don't know, like, preemptive down payment where you pay, like, up front for a hotel visit just in case you have to fucking stay there again. Yeah. So I had to pay, like, 70 fucking bucks 
to go to a fucking hotel I didn't even want to begin with and I had to pay a fucking down payment in case they decide to cancel my plane again. And so the next fucking day, I'm sorry I'm going on a bit of a rant. Would you let a mad scientist dissect your cock for $100? <laughs> Thank you for interrupting my, my story just for that. <laughs> no, no, I was just thinking about that. Wait, Wait, dissect my cock? Did you yeah, say $100? $100. Damn. On Damn. cryptocurrency. Uh, on cryptocurrency, no. With, with cryptocurrency. On real currency, no. I want more money if they're gonna dissect my cock. Okay, talk. what about two hundred dollars? With two hundred dollars? In, do in Dogecoin! In Dogecoin! In Dogecoin! In Dogecoin? It better be a million Dogecoin. Now, when you say mad, while he's dissecting Corey's cock, is he going, <laughs> Yes, he... yes, the cock, uh, yes. Okay, yeah. I'm yeah. adding more Doge currency to that, then, if they're going to be fucking laughing. Corey's well, laughing can... like an evil anime woman going, <laughs> Wait, Chris, do it again. <laughs> so, Corey, imagine that while your cock is getting dissected. There, by the way, there's I no... I didn't already... Uh, there's first no of all, I didn't, there's I didn't no agree. anesthesia. You already said yes, but there's no anesthesia, I didn't, though. No, yeah, I didn't. there's no anesthesia, and you've and got he's the $100 using, he's in using Joseph Mangala, Angel of Death, uh, uh, like, <laughs> ancient, like, rusted tools. Jesus. Yeah? Yeah. Kind of, but, but, but is, is this the fucking new? Wait, and Corey, and, 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 yeah. In Sonic Three, yes, you get to be in it. You get to be Sonic's best friend. Sonic Movie Three, yeah, but a, yeah, but, but a mad but with a dissected cock. With a dissected cock, Sorry, and I keep Sonic dying. has to go. Whoa, you got, you're the guy that got his cock dissected Whoa, by Corey. Eggman. That's pretty brave. Corey, you're brave. <laughs> I get all my inspiration from my friend Corey. Wait, wait Sonic says he got <laughs> his... Eggman was his first hold on, victim. Hold on. Sonic says he got his cock dissected well, on live television. Where did you television? think it went? <laughs> I've never had a cock in public. Where do you think, where do you think I like my chili dogs from? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. What? Why not? 